se stio cundum o virgines, modo con gaudete dos juvenes, o, o, totus floreo. Iam amore virginali totus arreo, novus novus amores copereo. But maybe many times I think love is in each person I meet. I love every person individually in a very special way. And maybe love is not special. Hey Ricardo, I didn't tell you to talk about your love life. Let's talk art. Come on. Cut. As soon as I arrived in Guangzhou in November 2014, I began planning my performance and my paintings towards my final solo exhibition. My presence in Korea did not happen by chance. I met uh, in Ricardo Matracas this year, January. Uh, one is a friend is uh, introduced to him. Uh, Mr. Jang Angi is uh, uh, one artist and leader. The so invite him. 그 작가를 어, 두 번째 봤을 때그 작가에 대한 어떤 느낌이 갑자기 제 눈에 들어오기 시작했어요. 어, 이야기를 나눌 때 어, 굉장히 아이처럼 천진한 면도 있지만 이런 어떤 여러 가지 면에서의 재능과 어떤 순수한 면들이 제 눈에는 들어왔기 때문에 그 작가에 대해서 관심이 가기 시작했습니다. 그래서 그때부터 그 작가와 함께 같은 퍼포먼스를 하거나 또는 큐레이터로서 그 작가를 도와주는 일이 굉장히 즐거워지기 시작했어요. 어, 그 작가의 8월에 어, 퍼포먼스 작품을 보았을 때 저뿐만이 아니라 그때 관객들도 그 작가의 퍼포먼스를 보고 굉장히 인상 깊은 감명을 받았는데 그게 뇌리에서 굉장히 오래 남았습니다. 어, 그 인상이 어떤 예술적인 아름다움 뿐만 아니라 어떤 미묘한 어떤 슬픔까지도 느껴지는 게그 장상이 오래 갈수 있었던 이유였던 것 같습니다. 그리고 어그 8월 이후 9월에 유럽 여행을 가게 됐는데 유럽에서 퍼포먼스 발표를 김광철 작가님과 저와 또는 I planned and painted with the use of my own style mainly in oil media. The technique I use for my paintings is very much inspired by Asian calligraphy. The line uh, follows the breath. It goes in and out. If the line is long, the breath will follow. Yeah, it's good works. Uh, and I miss it. Uh, interesting his uh, others' works. Painting is uh, uh, interesting also. A few days before the exhibition, Kyonghua Park drove us to Mr. Lee's house. Kwangju was covered by candied white snow that coming down slowed down our pace. <laughs> It was cold outside, but all felt so warm during that evening. We went to a local shop to buy some Korean treats. Oh no, this is an issue. How much all in all? Let's, let's divide it into two. How about the cigarette? Alcohol and cigarettes are kind of omnipresent wherever I went during that period of time. On the day we had to set up, I found out my old paintings were not completely dry. Actually, most of them. 
Monday, I think, two paintings. Yeah, yeah. And bring back. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, so we are looking if the ah, control, yeah. punch, fresh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I understand. I know you understand. You painter. Yeah. This no fresh, no problem. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> no fresh. Yeah. Cool. This also fresh. Yeah. And, and this fresh. is also fresh. Yeah. Okay. So these are very, very sensitive. Yeah, painter. yeah. Okay. So you shot this where? Here? The, uh, the one you're showing it to me? In Seoul. Ah, in Seoul, yeah. yeah. But I want to do in Guangzhou. Yeah. Okay, let's do it. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, after your exhibit. Yeah, right? yeah, after yeah. We'll do one day. I really love to do that. Because I'm sure you can really catch the best. Yes, from, of uh, course. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Mm. <laughs> One of the places we used to go for discussion in Guangzhou, it's a restaurant where I have been already many times with Mr. Gim and Mrs. Park, where I first discovered bandegi, the silkworms. I usually don't eat any meat, any fish, but I really wanted to try them. You like? Very much. Yeah. Mm. I like. Mm. Very good. Also paper? Yeah. yeah. Good choice. Yeah. <laughs> Very good. Mm. <laughs> congratulations in advance. Yeah, uh, it's strange when people say congratulations about putting some uh, paintings on the wall, like just hang something on the wall. Congratulations! Oh, thank you so much. I like the frame. <laughs> oh yeah, the frame is the best. No? <laughs> in the meantime, I decided to go and collect some barbed wire I needed for my performance. On my way back, the driver was putting the paintings in the car, one on top of the other. I felt like dying for a moment. And the first impulse was going straight to the car, telling the driver to stop and throw out the paintings from the boot. Many paintings needed to be restored at the end, since the black fresh paint was very attractive by the candid white just next to it. You have to tell them. Yeah, but it was a surprise because mm -hmm. I expect 11, mm -hmm. I come at 10.30 mm -hmm. and they already move. Mm -hmm. So, if not fresh, it's okay, you can yes. do so many things. The moment taught me that although physical things can be important to us and we can take care of them so much, they are still matter. Matter exists until it is destroyed. A matter as our physical body will eventually change its shape, its quality, and eventually transform into a different entity. Tohan, opening performance를 보면서 리카르도의 그 재치 있고 기치 있는 그런 오프닝 퍼포먼스를 보면서도 많이 좋았고 재밌고 같이. 해줬고 참석했던 관객들도 뜨거운 박수를 보냈어요. 보면서 
The use of breath is the key point of my technique. Each time I trace a line, I take a deep breath in, and as I breathe out, I trace the line that follows the length of the out breath. The reason I also make large sizes is because it is easier to use my whole body rather than just fingers and wrists. Each line is then accompanied by whole emotional and rational landscape that is defined by lines strategically put together to create an outline that circumscribes empty space. The empty space is represented by the white space, but still the empty space makes the inner space of the picture I make so that creates a fullness itself. This painting and the, that painting on your right and left, they are made both in Berlin. Uh, when I was there, I had a big studio, so I was like doing large scale. Um, all the rest of the works you see here, they are made here in Guangzhou. This, these two are made in Germany, 2011. Hi, ah, you, you brought it here? I brought two, yeah. Yes. But they traveled to London and then uh, Naples, and then I brought them from Naples to here. And they're gonna stay. <laughs> of so course. Their new home. <laughs> I decided to bring them with me in order to feel I wasn't starting from zero and I had a history. Perhaps I decided to bring them in order to feel my family and history following me. I used them as a, an anchor. So although my paintings can look sometimes overcrowded, that is just apparent because inside each body or object I create, there is an empty space contained by the lines Lines are for me the key of human journey. The journey brought me to Guangzhou, Korea. Guangzhou inspired me indeed. I feel almost born here, but my features deny that possibility. People. Yeah. Can you take one photo? Yes. Photograph. Okay. I think with this work, I think it can be nice. Yeah. Now? Yeah. Okay. Or, I don't know, you are, you are the creator in this moment, <laughs> so I don't know. <laughs> Whatever you like. Yeah, I think photo. Yeah, okay. I somehow feel I come from here. Perhaps it's because the latitude which connects my city, Naples, in Italy, to Guangzhou, in Korea with a sharp horizontal line that connects the two cities. So I began connecting their lines. I connected my own with other sculptures. I dug deep and found the key of resemblance. I will keep doing art and I will keep living as a... <laughs> like my, my, uh, my life as an artwork because uh, it's not only my life as an artwork, it's uh, me and all the people I connect with, we are one, we are one, and that's, uh, that's the main thing that makes me an artist. Whenever I travel to a new place, I can connect. I'm not happy to touch only the surface, and that's the same with people. Whenever I meet an individual, I like digging to discover the unanswered. Now. Uh? I'm angry, that's why. <laughs> In the morning, all together with the team, brought the titles and dimensions of the paintings. Numbers and dimensions are not my strength, and the curators did a hard work. In order to take care of the display, already knowing in its flesh, understanding each piece vital space where it most vibrated. This looks small. Small painting, but it's very big. Kyungwa Park and Beyond Hill ensured everything went smoothly. I felt almost they were the parents of my paintings. The host of La Fresco restaurant, Lin Yang Hun, 
who also owns one of my paintings nowadays, really helped the environment and made us feel at home. 여러 퍼포먼스 작품 중에서 리카르도의 작품을 보면서 좀더 많은 다른 생각을 갖다가 하게 되었고 또 작가의 어떤 표현이 무엇일까 궁금했었는데 또 우연찮게 또 광철 도움으로 음, 비엔날레 라프레스코에서 어, 전시회를 할수 있어서 많이 기대가 되고 기분이 좋았어요. 역시 에, 전시회를 통해서 작품을 보면서 퍼포먼스 작가로서의 어떤 평면 작품이 또 다르구나. On the same day of the exhibition, I had to retouch many of the paintings because they were ruined by the transportation in that moment. I think that's oil. Huh? Oil? Yeah. That's the problem. That's why it's still fresh. Mm. It takes ages. I thought about reconsidering acrylic paint as an option. But each time I trace a line, I might be too romantic, but the oil flows like water. And that quality can really imprint my movement as best. <laughs> can I take it off? <laughs> Measuring the canvases entitled in the work is a little like pampering each painting, assisting it, having an intimate moment where you find your nose close just a few centimeters from the canvas and can still smell the oil media that arises memories, touches swiftly the rough surface of the painting, where things are seen as they really are, as the scale factor of each spot from the material would absorb each small particle of the paint. I feel watching a painting so closely, feeling the material where it's been painted on, goes as deep as trying to find the meaning of life. When holding and unfolding the measure tape, I feel like embracing the canvas on its stretcher and together with that, I also stretch my arms in the meantime. I forget that I should just mathematically and distantly taking measurements, tightening the painting and go on with the work. But life is also amazing because we can imagine and our imagination can go very far whilst time disappears. I guess we should have more time for this in our ordinary lives, more time for contemplation. Game console, preparing the slideshow of when I cooked for 20 people using the kitchen of Lee Young-hun. The chef's performance was an idea by kyung -hwa. Just before the performance, I went to dress up for it. It was time to channel my energies together again. So I put it now? Uh, yeah. Or... I guess... Everything was in perfect timing. I asked people to position a spotlight on the top of the Kwanju Biennale's shelter, where I would have later climbed. You can wait for me. Huh? Don't start without me. Ah, no, 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 no. <laughs> go, go quickly and come back. Okay, okay, okay. The visitor is my final performance, The Patriot, is a parody of what's going on in the world. Everyone wanting a larger piece of land, expanding their boundaries. Probably they want to own the whole world, owning the world. How come are they so interested when it belongs to all of us? Aren't they interested to share evil world, evil greed? The way people deal with each other and the fact that uh, war exists and money exists and uh, belonging exists. If we won't belong things, that, that uh, would be a different world. No one belongs. This is not mine, this is not yours, it's everyone's. It, it would be, well, you need a different kind of consciousness in order to achieve that. So there are many things that make me angry, many things that make me happy. I went to Guangzhou, Biennale, and occupied for a while 
calling it Venice Biennale. I did it because Korea has been occupied in many occasions in the past and because I find it so sick. I wanted to ironically act around this matter. People come to foreign countries and they make it their own. So this is Quanju Biennale. I say, I'm Italian, Venice. <laughs> Venice Biennale. <laughs> so that's the point of this. But I'm against it because I think every, every place is uh, important. And uh, I think European curators who come here, they just uh, make the same as it is in Europe. So I, I just, uh, I'm a little against, it's good to mix, but it's not good to say what is good or what is bad. So that's my point. Anyway. Yeah. Just after my performance, I felt like a child who did something naughty by just swapping the name of Quanju Biennale into Venice Biennale. At the same time, I felt all the energies held together, although the patio performance was scattered in three different areas and audience had to follow. The history of the Venice Biennale dates back from 1895, when the first international art exhibition was organized. So I acted as someone who comes from Italy and claims the Venice Biennale to be the most important in the world. It's a joke, in my opinion. I am from Italy, but my soul has been designed to connect to all other souls that, on my humble opinion, create one soul one entity, one larger body seen from farther away, containing all of us small cells. It was fun for me, I much fun. Yeah, it's a very interesting and very nice show. Like a film. You want film? Yes. Here we are. Yeah. Film. Kyungwa <laughs> driving. Kyungwa <laughs> 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 style is a uh, very dynamic style. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I speak very slowly when you... Ah, yeah, I do all the time. Okay. Ah, right, right, right. So, I, um, I was supposed to have a rope to come down. Ah, uh, so, your mother. <laughs> thank you, Mama. No problem. Mama, thank you. For <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> Okay, I'll go and take out the light. <laughs> that was superb, man! Did you like it? Yes, of course! Great! Oh, I wait for you! I wait for you! For you! You know? Nice to see you. Old faces came back and the philosophy professor came also to witness the evening. We finally reconnected after Quanju Biennale and philosophical talks about death. I brought you in it's true? Yeah. Yeah. Many people I didn't know came at the opening, but also people who I got to know during my residency in Guangzhou. After my performance, I gave a speech and thanked everyone to be there. Um, all the rest of the works you see here, they are made here in Guangzhou. I also gave to someone the jacket used for it. The jacket, uh, performance jacket. The jacket was bought in Dognio Market in Seoul and had already a history on its own since it was second hand when I bought it. A guy asked me to sign a napkin where I sprayed some paint during my performance. So two ordinary objects, jacket and tissue, became precious for someone and probably for them they became also tools for contemplation. The exhibition has been supported by curators Kyonghua Park and Byung Hun with Gim Kwan Chol, La Fresco Restaurant team, Ji Hong Ki and Hollywood Studio Residency team in Yaring Dong. Each person became a key part of a final successful exhibition. Pipo Domagas came straight from the Philippines in order to document the exhibition and final performance. Somehow we connected straight away and it felt too short time together. We had many ideas that unfortunately could not be completed. Somehow Peace and Ferocity solo exhibition was actually a group exhibition in my opinion rather than my solo exhibition. It's been only possible because a great team was surrounding me. Pipo Domagas, more than a filmmaker, is a dancer of the moving recorded image. 
has been my recording eye during preparation and exhibition itself. Mr. Gim has instead been the third eye together with the curators. Myself and people went to eat in the midst of the vibrant scene of Kwanju. I was transporting a painting from an exhibition place to another. For some reasons it looked like a performance. Transporting an artwork can trigger people's curiosity. With people everything became an act to be recorded because of passion. I feel perhaps passion is one of the key points to make things possible. Passion and action. In most cultures in the world, the place where most things happen is where you eat all together. Kwanju has made me miss such moments, where food is talking about future and dreams, about planning and overall, where restaurants allow painters to draw on their wall. In the evening after the exhibition, we ended up in a place where there were some friends waiting. It wasn't the first time they happened. In Kwanju, me and Kwan Chol actually collaborated many times during our food sessions. I ended up loving those places because they understand when something is made with energy. Eventually, the painting will be still there after years, and after an exhibition seemingly elitarian, painting on the wall was the best moment of my final show because it is inclusive and it is destined to a wider audience. The full, the full, the full. The day after, people's host Mr. Lee, Gina, people and I went to find a place for a street performance. I wanted to make war with myself using Molotov bombs. We prepared everything, petrol, glass bottles, fabric, everything was ready to make at least 20 Molotov bombs in order to fight with myself. At the end, we could not find a suitable place for it, it could have been too dangerous. The idea was finding an abandoned concrete place to do that, but we were surrounded by a beautiful landscape, where even a war with the self would not be possible. So I did not perform. On the way back, Mr. Lee's car broke down so that we had to take a taxi. Mr. Lee drove us everywhere we wanted to go to and he supported with most of our mad projects. But his car decided to give up for him. Whilst waiting for a rescue service, we went to find a taxi. It was very difficult to get a taxi because we had barbed wire with us and two boxes of glass bottles. Taxi driver looked at us as we were nutters, so we had to walk. Yeah. Mr. Lee also cooked a live octopus for us in order to feel welcome. The small particular thing is that I am vegetarian and I rather not eat it, but homely hospitality should never be denied. <laughs> Oh, now the chadu rop chingapta. No, 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 I, I do so many things in art, like I'm painting and I do projects uh, involving audience, participants, I dance, whatever I do. But I think the most important thing uh, for an artist is to understand that art is uh, everywhere. It's everywhere in our daily lives. So I really believe that uh, that each moment of our life is actually uh, a piece of art, but you cannot record it. So, <laughs> um, it's very important to me to highlight this part. So people tell me, ah, you are an artist because you paint, you are an artist because you, 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 you dance, but I think, no, I am an artist because I live my life fully f with poetry. 
So I, I think that's a very important thing. But it's always important to keep humble. To keep humble is, uh, for me, the most important part of being an artist. Because if I do something great, it doesn't mean anything. Because I was just a channel. And just being a channel means being humble to the universe. And if I'm humble to, to the universe, the universe come into me. I give the universe to the people. So for me, it's very important to remember, to be happy about something I've done, but forget, because I'm nothing just one minute afterwards. So I might be the universe for a moment and people think I am the universe forever. No, I was the universe. When I offered that emotion, when I off offered that vibration, but now I'm nothing. So that's uh, my point about uh, art and being an artist. Arrogance is for the people who want to be arrogant. Arrogance is for the people who think they are great and they are the best ever. I think each individual is very important. I think each individual can offer something very special. Um, and I am a little part of all this big organism. Hey Ricardo, I'm, I'm on the other, other side, side of the universe. universe. That's, That's tough, tough love. Come on. Senza sol, senza sol, senza sol, senza sol. 